Hello, I'm Josh. I'm Ollie. And today we are doing a Jolly Ramyeon World Cup Part 2. It's all about the sequels. Mate, it's look sequels. at this! It's all about the sequels. Joy! Alright, you've had a quick glimpse. Now you're not going to see them anymore because we're going to take them out of the shop and bring them in one by one. This World Cup, we're going to be judging all international Ramyeons by the standard of Indomie. The bar is set high. So, Indomie. Ah, uh, yes. Original. Not original. Mi goreng ache. And finally, Hype Abyss. Can I say, I said it last time, yeah. but it's even stranger with three in front of us. It just yeah. looks like three toupees. <laughs> You're an idiot. Yeah. You're an idiot. <laughs> you know? Justin Tim Blake toupees. Yeah. Mmm. 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 Mm. <laughs> That's better than I remember it being. That's it's so kind of good. Sweet. Mm. The noodles are like perfectly done. Okay, now this one is called Mi goreng eke. Ache. Ache. Ache is an area of Indonesia. Oh, look at this guy, he knows. Mmm. Interesting flavor. Ooh, ooh. Got a bit of a kick. Yeah. Tastes like, almost like bath soap. Oh, oh but you know, you know sometimes bath soap smells so great you kind of want to eat it. Never, never eat it. <laughs> <laughs> Final up, yeah, we've got Hype Abyss uh, Rasa Ayam Geprek. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Mm. <coughs> that is. Whoa! That one is spicy! Whew, it hits you in the back of the throat! <laughs> My taste buds are hyped. <laughs> I think I actually need milk. Mm. <sighs> Whew. Uh. Oh my gosh. I was suffering so much that Gabby said she wanted to try it. Gabby's way better at it. The thing is, the first us. bite. Yeah. It's not that bad. Second bite. Hit me in the throat. Double the, throat. the spice. Good. Okay. Mm -hmm. She's really good with spice food, so I bet she can eat all of that and not have a problem. Nothing? She's like, nothing. This is double the spice now. You go in a drove. <laughs> How is she going to handle it? You know what taste that? Triple the spice. <laughs> <laughs> Triple. <laughs> Are you that serious? Well, I was sweating out of the back of my head. I'm going to disappoint me. Tell me, I mean, that is it. Like, disappointment! Hang disappointment! On. What? Gabby, it is, spi is as spicy as Prince of Is it? It's good, it's like a good spice. That was a little bit embarrassing. Yeah. Next time we get Gabby to try something, yeah. it has to basically murder us beforehand. Yeah. Whoa! Ooh. Sick! Thank you, Gabby. First impressions, Josh. Yeah. That nice. does not look like that. This is what you would expect from ramyeon. The noodles though, they look pretty sad. So stepping up to the plate for Thailand. Ooh. A uh, big shout out to View. And these I believe are a tom, tom yum guk. Tom yum. Yes, yeah, so you know tom yum soup? No. Okay, it's like a spicy sour seafood soup. Wait, everyone in, in the room is nodding. Everyone knows it's like the most famous Thai dish. No, that's a pad thai. It's okay. a dish got thai in, like, in the name. <laughs> 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 Alright. Right. Mm. It's got that kind of lavender flavour. I'm okay with that, you know. I don't, I don't I wasn't love sure it. How I was going to feel I about it. I love it. I love Thailand and pad thai, but I don't love this. It's got that classic sort of spicy sour taste you'd expect from a tom yum. It tastes very authentic. Definitely not as Moorish and addicting flavour as the Indomie. All right, Thailand. Uh, yeah, strong, strong representative. Yeah. Better than a couple of the ones yeah, from yeah. last year's World Cup. Yeah, yeah, almost Definitely. like the England World Cup team. We're not going to win, but it, it's Doesn't always win. respectable. And then you go out to Germany on penalties. Puts up a good fight. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. All right, well, let's see who they go out to on penalties, shall we? Okay, next up, coming in from Singapore, we have two representatives, Coca and Cup Noodle. This wow. is like an iconic yeah, brand. Yeah, this is iconic, right? This one deserves an extra shout out because this, yeah, it's from Singapore. Flavor is Korean army stew. Pude jjigae. This is the first one that so, yeah, I will have yeah. had that I've actually had the dish it's based off. And we've also got coca noodles. Gotta say, visually, this is probably the least appealing so far. It's like JT's bedhead. Doesn't smell of anything. <laughs> on a bad day. Enough with Justin Timberlake. <laughs> right, I'm gonna give it a go. I'm gonna give it a try. Okay, okay. okay don't swing it. It's not swing it. Stop I'm gonna playing, swing it into my mouth. Food. No, you're not. That's not gonna work. <laughs> you can whip yourself in the eye. Oh, yeah. I'm Stained your neck. 
Good. Very good job. That tastes better than it looks. Uh, it's almost reminiscent of English noodles. It's not disgusting. Mm, that's true. That is true. Like it's English very noodles, bland. It's very bland. All right. Now look at this. This visually, these cup noodles look like they might be very similar to pot noodles. The English noodles that oh we my showed were an absolute disgrace. Like the English one though, there is something that you're supposed to pour in the top. Thankfully, unlike the English one, this isn't ketchup. I think this is chili oil. It looks, woo! It's red oil. It's red. Ah, oh, because it's Buddha Jige. It's supposed to be spicy. Okay, this is chili paste. Mix. Ooh, okay, okay. That they have with chili crab. See that, I've got to say, that is a bit more worrying looking. It looks like the, the crab swam into an oil slick. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Let's get stuck in, shall we? Oh, that is good. Mm -hmm. Oh, my. Little chunks of ham in there. Gosh. Is that one good? Because this one is, this one's pretty oh, good. good. Bude jige, though. It doesn't really taste like bude jige. This might even have it on... Uh, Indomie. Indomie. Well, I need to taste what you're trying, because this one is not as good as Indomie. The colour has gone a lot darker since you mixed in that chilli tar. It doesn't taste anything like Buda Jika. Right? It tastes good. It tastes good. Isn't that great? It's like sweet and, cra wow. and crabby. This one is a, maybe a winner so far. I think wow. so. Wow. Like, Indomie's mm. great. It's almost like a two-dimensional flavour. I see what you mean. I see what it's you mean. like an 8D experience. 8D! Considering how instant that is, all you have to do is pour hot water in from a kettle. That's incredible. Strong World Cup entry from Singapore. So Next fun. up. Dun, dun, dun! Wow, that looks legit. It looks like the laxa did. That one looks like the laxa. That look, that's good. The brand's called Chef. Mami Chef. And this is a Parisa Long Tong Long Tong flavor. <laughs> <laughs> I love that name. Product of Malaysia. And it looks good. So it looks creamy. Looks kind of almost like a green curry sort of colour. Yeah. It's got that oily sauce, which yeah. looks great. Nicely done. Malaysia has entered the chat. <laughs> <laughs> yes, they have. That is, yes, that is good. They have. That walks a fine line between not too intense and very flavourful. And it walks it well gotta say. One caveat, even if I was hungry, which having eaten four servings of <laughs> ramyeon, I'm not, I couldn't eat all of that. Are you serious? I could literally finish that in a second. This guy knocks out cup noodles in the semi-finals. Not I've just noticed fine. something on the cup noodle which makes me respect this. What's that? I would say if this was a real World Cup, this yes. is extra points for sportsmanship. Okay, how so? <laughs> on the front, there's a label that says real picture of product. Oh, very good. It's obvious at this stage that Cup Noodle's not gonna win the World Cup, but I think yeah. Cup Noodle gets the moral victory. Definitely. Round of applause, moment of silence for, for round of applause and a moment of silence. It, it's literally impossible. <laughs> now comes we'll the silence. We'll have to enter a different dimension. <laughs> You're an idiot. You're an idiot. <laughs> All right, final one. Ramyun World Cup! All right, final entry. This one is from Korea. This is a new Korean ramen. And this is a Mara. Mara. Your face. You said that we were never going to eat that again. <laughs> so Mara is like, it's becoming a bit of a craze in Korea. And so they're, they're mara fying a lot of different dishes around Korea. Okay. I'm also really curious to see which one is going to be more spicy. Spicy Indomie. Or this guy. Go for it, mate. Nice and conservative with a little bite over there. Oh. The smell. <coughs> this is more spicy. This is more spicy. Oh, I do not like that taste. It's like fire noodles plus plus uh, bar, 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 barbecue 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 sauce. That's hot. That's hot. You are red. This is hot. Forget everything I said earlier. That Indomie wasn't spicy. Whew. Okay, that's the most aggressive team in the World Cup. Very <laughs> aggressive, but disqualified. Red card. Red card. Disqualified. Right. Okay. Is that the final one? That's the final one. Woo! This has been Ramen World Cup Part 2. Who's the winner? I would say, you know, 
The winner? Uh, again, I think we have to have a tie. Is this your winner? <laughs> <laughs> uh, <laughs> come on! <laughs> okay. Was it this or Indomie for you? Indomie. Indomie, flipping heck! No, 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 it's a tie, it's oh, a tie. Uh, but this is a really nice baby in there. A soup noodle. Best soup noodle. Yeah, for me, I'm gonna say best soup noodle is Chef. Okay. I take this over that and dry noodle, Indomie. Oh crap, I've just noticed the expiration date on this one. What? When? Huh? April 2018. <laughs> 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 That's a year we'll and a half. We'll probably be fine. We'll probably be fine. <laughs> It's been quite a journey. Yeah. Asian noodle game. Well played. You put us all to shame. And uh, if you want to see us do a part three and have any recommendations for us, send them to our PO box. Yeah, and let us know in the comments below. We'll put the uh, address in the description. In the meantime, we'll see you Joy soon. See you later. Peace. That is insane.